Okay, uh, I'm here to do another example problem, and this problem uh, talks about ordering in both lex order and dictionary order. Okay, so in part A, we're looking at dictionary order. At part B, we're looking at both dictionary and length first lex order. And in part C, we're looking at lex order. Okay, and uh, we'll see if I can fit this one onto one page. Uh, Basically, uh, we're looking at the set sigma, which contains uh, the elements x and y in order. Okay, and you can tell that this isn't just a set. This is actually a list because it has these rounded uh, parentheses rather than brackets for a set. And so these, the x and the y are in order. And they call it an alphabet here, but it's really just a list of elements in a set that are in order. Um, and <clears throat> we're looking at sets of strings over this alphabet. And basically, we're, we're forming, uh, you know, things like x, x, y, x, y, x, 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 y, 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 uh, any combinations of x's and y's. We're basically building words out of this alphabet, okay? Um, and so in part A, we're looking at palindromes. Those are strings that read the same forward and backward of length less than or equal to 4, list them in dictionary order. Well, every time I try to do dictionary order, it seems like I miss an element or two and I have to go back and fix it. Uh, and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to list the elements, I'm going to list the palindromes of less than length less than or equal to 4 first, and then I'm going to list them in dictionary order. So I'm going to start with part A here, and I'm going to write down the palindromes. And X is a palindrome. Uh, let me write them out vertically, sort of. Uh, so X is a palindrome. Y is a palindrome. If I go to length 2, the only ones that are palindromes are XX and YY. XY is not a palindrome because when you reverse it, it becomes YX, which is not the same. It's not the same forward and it's backwards. On length 3, I have XXX and I have XYX. I have y, 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 and of y, x, y. There are no other palindromes of length 3. Uh, for example, x, y, y is not the same forwards as backwards. Okay, so the only way to make palindromes of length 3 are to either have uh, all three of them the same or to just replace the middle one with a different letter. Okay, um, so these are palindromes up to length 3. Now when I get to length 4, I have, of course, all four x's. And now I can replace two at a time. I can replace y, y, x. And I can go all four y's. And I can replace the middle two with x's. I think that's all there are. Um, let me think here. Um, yeah, that's all I can do. So I have one, two... 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 strings here that I need to list in dictionary order. Dictionary order has, first of all, just like a dictionary, it has a section for the A's, uh, a, a section for the B's and C's, and within each of those, uh, it starts with the shortest ones and works on uh, well, just exactly the same way a dictionary works. If the first few letters match, um, then you put the shortest one first, and for subsequent letters, that is after the match, you put them in alphabetical order. And that's what we're going to do here. Uh, X and Y are already in alphabetical order, so that helps us out here. So I'm going to make my X section first. So here's dictionary order for this set. I'm going to do the X section first, and uh, so this is the first one that starts with an X. Here's the next one that starts with an X, two X's. Now the question is, for example, what's next, um, XXX or XYX? Well, XXX is next because XYX would be after that. How about if I... Do what I say I'm going to do here. X, X, X. 
And then I think I need to get all four x's before I put any x, y. x, y, and there's only one that's, there's only two that start with uh, x, y, and they're x, y, x, and x, y, y, x. Now I think I've got all six of them that start with an x. One, two, three, four, five, six. And is this in dictionary order? It is because they all have the same x, and then in every vertical column here, they're in order, starting with a blank coming before any letter in the alphabet. And so now, I've done the x's, and the y's are going to follow exactly the same pattern. y, 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 y. Now, four y's, and finally y, x, y, and y, x, x, y. Now, just a second here. I'm trying to follow the same pattern, but I've got a problem, because y, x has to come before y, y. So I'm going to try that again. I'm going to go y, and then y, x has to come next, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh, and then I have to have y, x, x, y. And then I can move to the y, y's. And then y, 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 and then quadruple y. Now let's see, is that in dictionary order? Spaces come before any letter. And I go in order, I get to the x's before I get to the y's, I get to a space before I get to an x, I get to a space before I get to a y. This looks correct, and I'm going to simply cross that out. And dictionary order goes down like that. Okay? I'm going to stop here and do part B in another video. So this is dictionary order for all the palindromes of length less than or equal to 4. And it's tricky, dictionary order, as I said, I always seem to, to do it wrong first, and only after I check do I straighten it out. Okay? Hope that helps.